Never saw a pronghorn before until I got into Oklahoma. These are the second fastest animals in the world and the fastest in the USA. Also saw uh, a few little prairie dogs. Up here, the road. Oh, cool. We are in New Mexico. First trail in New Mexico right here. Looks like a good road. I'm ready. New Mexico. Damn, that didn't take us long this morning. We we didn't know how close we were. We're right here. He's a couple bulls too, buddy. I will be all right. <laughs> well, I got red on. I think I'm going to get on the other side of you. I got to get up. Mm. Yeah, these are bulls. What's up, big daddies? Oh, moly. <laughs> <laughs> he was getting up. Was he? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm like, okay, I'm gonna see if I can outrun Chris. <laughs> no. All right. Camera off. This road isn't too bad. Well, I won't say shit. It'll jinx us. This is the topography in New Mexico. Just yep. about. Just okay. about. Cool. Yeah. We were like, what, 10, 15 minutes away from New Mexico? Yeah. Wow. But we picked a great, a great place to stay. Yeah, it was a great place to camp. The Oklahoma Bunkhouse. Great Plains. A Great Plains Bunkhouse, I'm sorry, in Oklahoma. Great Plains Bunkhouse. Yeah. Honor system. Yeah, snacks for you, kitchen for you, you can get rooms, you can camp. And plenty of place to socialize around a little pond, a little assembly hall on a porch. Pretty cool. Had a good night's sleep, actually. And a couple of yard cats. Yep. Or kittens. And a freaking rooster that didn't know when to crow when the sun came up. He crowed before the sun came up. Bunch of freaking coyotes howling throughout the night. I heard some owls, but no coyotes. Oh, they were making all kind of racket. Several times. It was like, felt like they were right there. Really? Yeah. I'm more afraid of them than anybody, any person. Especially if they're in a pack. I felt something twice. Slap my tent. I thought it was a kitten. It was probably kittens because the bugs and stuff, they were, right. they were playing by mine. But I didn't have any problem going to sleep. I uh, did. I don't think I really, really slept, but I had to because I woke up. It was 5.30. Yeah. But I was a light sleep. Yep. Well, I like this. I'm going to turn my camera off. Signing off. Wow. Topography sort of changed all of a sudden. Went from flat to hilly. Yep. Wow. Now we're in a valley. Beautiful, isn't it? Yes, it is. Ready when you are. Woo-wee. I'm going to take a picture.
of that fall. Got it climbing up a hill? I'm sure, maybe. And everything else is not. Maybe they got tired of people sliding off. Going down the cliff. Well, we're going to speed limit. A little bit ahead of it. Look how sandy. <laughs> yeah, this is a hairpin. Well, how you like in New Mexico so far? It's definitely different. It's definitely different. I like it. Went from the plains to all of a sudden desert, flat, and to now mountain, you know, yeah, hilly. Yeah, we kind of went from wooded over in Arkansas yeah. to the hilly grazing area, open range, to the sand, Oklahoma mud. We got it all. We've been blessed by the temperatures being lower than normal. Yeah, really. This is the perfect shirt. It's got climb written on it. <laughs> and it did really, really good sliding across that mossy part. Yeah, where everybody goes down. Except for Moto Giant. And I would have gone down had he not told me to walk it across. Yeah, he was up <clears throat> hollering, but I was already on the ground sliding toward him. I thought I was going to take him out. Look at these cool rocks up here. Yeah. It's all cool. That's just neat. Awesome landscaping. Yep. All right. Now back into the sandy stuff. Sandy, rocky stuff. All right. I'm going to turn my camera off. Well, right, right around this. We stopped in the valley and enjoyed the mountain topography as we took our lunch break. Uh, it was beautiful scenery. Enjoyed the change from Oklahoma. It was a drastic change though. Recording. We should get cell service up here. You think? Yep. We're out in the boonies now. Rocky Mountain home. Mm-hmm. Oh, I see it. But 